One of the neat things about Cabela design pieces is there's so many options as far as making beautiful pendants that are so simple. And then just simply with chain and jump rings, um, adding beads, you can make some nice um, pieces. Uh, by making connections. One thing we're going to do, which is a piece I really love, we're going to take one of um, these pieces um, that is a, made in three parts and it has a nice um, opening here that fits a Swarovski Rivoli quite nicely. So we're going to take the jewelry metal glue and add it to the back of our crystal, put a little bit into this opening, and just set it in there. And that will take about 10 or 15 minutes to, to dry. And you can see that would be a beautiful focal piece. Um, you could wear it just like that. You can add some other um, crystals to it, to a chain. Um, here are some really nice pieces that were just made simply by connecting a crystal to the chain, one of the small filigree uh, Cabela pieces, and then taking one of the um, caps and bending it over a stone. And here's another idea of taking one of the filigree wraps, wrapping it around a stone, and then some head pins, adding some beads on there and making some dangles and then creating connectors. And it doesn't take a lot of beading experience to be able to create something like this just to have some creative ideas and experiment. And then this piece here was um, made by wrapping a stone and then taking one of the chandelier earring pieces, making a bell, and then a cap and gluing in a Swarovski crystal. And then you can see in the back what I did is I wrapped the chandelier piece around a big jump ring and connected it in the back and that makes a pendant. So there's so many creative ideas and options um, that are pretty simple as far as technique wise um, that you can create with these lovely Cabela design components and filigree pieces.